Hi guys, welcome back to more PES 6. Today we're at home against Portsmouth, and to be honest, right, Portsmouth uh, would be very nervous because today every single one of our players on the field, apart from one being Saviola, of course, um, is on red form. So yes, we've put out a full red squad form squad apart from Saviola who's on green because I'm gonna play it was either him or Aguero Aguero is on orange form however I've decided that I'm gonna go with um, Saviola just to you know get him get him some more game time see if he can try and prove himself you know that at this point in the season you know what I mean he's got a red form team behind him so he's got you can't say he's got bad support but um, yeah, Benatera is actually going to go onto the right wing for this one because he's got a little bit more pace than Bastek. Bastek is in the uh, centre. There's no Mutu or anything today. Again, you know, it's just one of those. It just is just another game where it's a case of well, we've already won the league and whatnot. So it's a savvy savvy all the scores straight away, and this is the worst possible start for Portsmouth because Portsmouth really need the points. Manchester City and Bolton are playing each other today, and um, to be honest. Charlton are away at Middlesbrough and um, they would probably both hope Portsmouth and Charlton that Man City could win that game and the reason for that is because Man City's goal difference is only minus 8 whereas I think Bolton is like minus 20 or something like that so yeah to be honest if they're going to pick one of those teams to win it's going to have to be uh, Man City you would hope so um, yeah that's uh, something there, but we're one up already in this one. And uh, yeah, Chu Young's playing today. We got Mafio in the uh, D one of the DMF positions. Swapped him out for Ono. Um, we got Company in there with Maldini. This is really bad though. Kushak's on red form though, so that's all right. Uh, Scare oh, um, Maldini, Company, the three at the back. Um, who else we got in there? Um, I think that's it actually. We got we got Pedretti in one of the DMF positions. Uh, and that's it today guys so yeah quite uh, looking forward to this one based on that and here's Saviola again and he'll get it well he's up for it today is, is Saviola coming back right at the end of the season he's up for a hat trick if he can get a hat trick <laughs> maybe he can just about prove that to me I don't know but uh, Chu Young is back today we haven't seen him in a while you know, he's not had the best. He has scored some good goals and some uh, vital goals for us. He got that double against uh, Chelsea in the cup, didn't he, when we was at home? And that was a vital couple of goals that he did get. So, um, yeah. That's two already, though. Mutu, obviously, on the bench. Uh, Guerra might come on. I don't know, to be honest, yet. This is really bad for Portsmouth, though. We'll have to check up on how that... Um, how that... Um, uh, Charlton game is going at half time but here's Loa Loa meanwhile and it's pulled back to Davis who got his shot in but he couldn't get it on target but he still got it Kushak makes a great save and it's out of play for a Portsmouth corner they uh, definitely have to check up on what's going on in that uh, Bolton Man City game at half time it's just about the relegation battle now really isn't it it's, it's exciting stuff and here's Chu Young over to uh, Saviola, puts the ball over to Chu Young, it's Chu Young, Chu Young shot, it's 3-0 already, and this is an absolute disaster, this is a nightmare for Portsmouth, their bid to survive, there's only going to be two games left after this one, they didn't pick up Chu Young, Saviola wasn't really making a run there, but I guess it didn't matter in the end, but you know what I mean, Saviola, kind of expect him to make more of a run there, he's just sort of, he stops, like right there, and just expects Chu Young to do it all on his own, which he did, I, uh, I guess to be fair, that's three goals in 13 minutes there, or well, technically I guess 14, but yeah, that is insane, this could be, this could be an absolute route today, if Portsmouth aren't careful, and that will do no good for their goal difference at all, because they need it. And brought down there by, I think, company. No penalty for that. And uh, here's Saviola. He's got no support. And Saviola's just going to run through. Wow. Just how easily did he get through there? That could have been a fourth immediately. 
And stolen away yet again here. And it's Saviola who's going to make it four. And what is going on with this Portsmouth? It's like they've given up already. Well, we couldn't. He's got the hat trick already. And uh, we we said, you know, this is a bit too easy, and this is too easy. I'm not. Uh, who's that in goal? Because I'm not rating him. Look, there's that gap in the defence, and he, Saviola's got through again, and all he's got to do from there is tap it into the net. The goalkeeper's not making himself big enough. It's 4 0, not even 20 minutes on the clock here. Well, I, I suppose we, we are technically in the 20th minute, I suppose, but you know what I mean. Yeah, the first minute counts as one. And it's Taylor, it's Mirari. And that's actually, oh, it was a decent ball, but it's offside. It's game over for Portsmouth, this one. Easily game over. It would be a complete disaster if they came back from this. Not that it matters to us that much anyway, if that did happen. And that's a really good ball through. No, it's not. Ball in. Five. You know what? Based on this, Portsmouth deserve to go down. This is shocking. And Savio, the, on the only one on our team has got four goals already in this game. The only one on our team who's not got a red form arrow. And it's as simple as this. Just throwing it to Chu Young. He just runs a little bit. Passes it into the box. There's four or five men there. It picks out Saviola and it's a goal. And it's we're averaging like a goal every five minutes now, kind of. Just about. I want more out of this. I want, I want seven, eight, nine, please. Ten. It's going that way. We've got plenty of time to get a ten. Yeah, I mean, we didn't even got like the likes of Urbina or Mutu on here. Although maybe some would argue that Saviola's... I mean, Saviola's stats are better than Urbina's, but Urbina's got some really good pace that I do like and maybe prefer. And that's dreadful ball in there. And Cole's on for Taylor. It's too, it's too little too late, honestly. It's not going to make any difference. And uh, Pedretti's going to try and chase that down. It's back out. And it's Mafio and it's over to Benatira and this is some one touch passing that's gone really good here for us. And that is unbelievable really. That I shouldn't if I if I if my team had conceded a goal like that I'd have been just spitting feathers, honestly. I mean, I almost want to say that Portsmouth need to go down a division and have a rethink about their team here and um, come back up, you know, try and get back up when they think they're ready to compete again at this level. And it's very strange, though, because back in the reverse fixture of this, we, I think we only won 2-0 and it was, uh, it was, it was a decent game. It wasn't the best game ever, but still... Here's uh, Chu Young, and that was some good defending there from, I think, Campbell. That's better defending. That's more like it. And uh, run pass there. Andy Cole will get onto the end of it. Oh, but here's Thompson. And it's Benatira to try and take it out. Ball in. He's going to miss the target. Nearly at half time here. And it's Benatira. Oh, and he's lost it. Never mind. Maybe could have crossed it into the box, that. 
But here's Matthew. Ball in. Lamalawa taken away. Here's Benatira. Ball in. Oh, it's gone over the head of Saviola. Here's Sahin. Sahin's playing today. I don't think I mentioned that, did I? But he, he's definitely there today. Again, another red form player. Ball up the field. It's probably going to be half time. Oh, it's offside from Andy Cole. Uh, at least Andy Cole looks like he's maybe half trying. <laughs> Benatira. Oh, into the box. How are we going to get a corner out of that? No, we're not. That's going to be half time. Ah. Uh, well, you wouldn't. <laughs> it's no surprises, for, you know, what we've seen from our team this season, but this is something else um, today. I just want to say we've had six shots and all six on target. Yeah, 100% accuracy so far from us. Here's Mafio out wide to Benatira. Menatira is going to beat that man with ease. And he's still got it. And, oh, that's unlucky. Could have been the seventh right there. And it's uh, Mafio who's going to drag it across the box. And uh, Saviola's still got it. It's in there. Oh, it's close. Ah, oh, can't get it to any of our players. They're picked up by Kushak easily. Got Arsenal coming up next. <laughs> this is this is somewhere to warm up for that one. I'll tell you that. And uh, well done by Benatira, has kept hold of that. Here's Pedretti, it's out to Sahin. Sahin's going to try and cut inside, he's got us a corner. Saviola will take it, into the middle. Oh, come on, it just feels like there's a seventh coming here pretty soon. Into the middle, oh, just over the bar from, I think, Hitera. Maybe Portsmouth playing slightly better defensively, but only slightly, if you ask me. It's Glenn Johnson. And, uh, Booted right into Chu Young there. Poor Chu Young. And Saviola out to Sahin. Look at all this space. Sahin buries it. Seven. And I don't think we've got seven this season. That's the first time I think we've got it in a in a match. In fact, in fact, the entire series, I don't think we've managed to hit seven yet. But look at this. I mean, Campbell, I think he's meant to be on the left side of the two centre-backs. So, don't know where the other guy was, but it's allowed him enough time to run in there and get that shot away. And, uh, yeah, we're looking for an eighth now, if possible. But here's Dwala, who's uh, going to get enough time there, but uh, cut out. That's really bad, and Kushak gets to it. That was maybe a little lucky. His company. Now, something I forgot to do is look at the... Um oh, that's a good ball. Is look at the, uh, the half-time score. I was so... I'm, I'm so sort of, you know... Chu oh, Young, never mind. Uh, so, sort of like focusing on this this game and what's going on in it. I forgot to even do that, so I will check it um, at the end of the game.
Cut out. I don't really want to bring anybody off, but I'm going to bring Sahin off. Um, for Walcott, and that'll do. Um, and then I've got Aguero coming on too. Uh, it's Benatira into the middle. Here's uh, Mafio. He's going to try and put it back in there somewhere. Ooh. Yeah, definitely not played as well as we did in the first half, that's for sure. Portsmouth have upped their game a little bit, but only very slightly. And uh, this Dawala guy here, he seems to be... Oh, he seems to be like... If I had to pick one of their best men, it would be him today. And that's cut out. So I was going to bring Maldini off, but with his stamina being low, but... To be honest, might as well play him, get a full game going for him. That's a good ball out, but uh, not going to get to that. And uh, Kushak picks up again. Good ball out to Saviola once more. And a free kick given against Portsmouth there. The subs will finally come on. It's the, uh, what, what, 89th minute? <laughs> And they're only going to get a chance to come on now. And... Nah, it's not worth shooting on that, to be honest. Aguero's just going to pop it into the box. It's a little too far, actually, though. It's going to be kept in. Just about. Here's Mutu. He's just come on and decided I'm just going to bring Mutu on. It'd be good if he could add to the tally today. <laughs> Um, and he might, oh, I was going to say he might just do that, but he's not lucky enough there. It's going to be a 7-0 win, I reckon, now. And it is. Ah. Before. Oh. <laughs> Our best win yet. Not looking so good. 4.5 for their guilt goalkeeper. I did not rate him. I just thought he was shocking today, honestly, but... Looking at our side, Saviola with the 8.5. Yeah, I agree with that. Bastic, only a 5.5. Didn't see too much of him, though, saying that, though. I don't remember that much of him at all. I remember seeing, like, Benatira quite a few times. Near Sahin. If he didn't get the goal, he might have just gotten, like, a plain 6 or a 5.5 or something. I don't know. Uh, Mafia thought was good. Yeah, we was good at the back. And, uh, and that's that. Anyway, the fixture 28 results. Charn have got a vital point there going to Middlesbrough. So that's uh, that's decent for them. Uh, but Bolton and Manchester City has finished 1-1. So it doesn't really matter too much. They could, have, as, uh, Like I said, they could have done with a Man City win there. But um, yeah, uh, Arsenal have actually lost at home to Blackburn 2-0. Chelsea have beaten Newcastle 1-0. Fulham have gone to White Hart Lane and won 1-0 against Spurs. Manchester United have beaten West Ham at home 2-1. And Liverpool have actually lost away at Aston Villa 1-0. So here's the uh, league table. Two games to go. Um, Chelsea just about secure. They can actually secure it in the uh, next game week. Uh, to get the uh, second place, the automatic position for Europe. Um, still game on though, still game on there because um, West Ham and Aston Villa can still get that sixth place there for Europe. I think Tottenham will definitely get that now. Um, I suppose you never know yet. Uh, moving down to the bottom though, this is what we uh, sort of want to see. Blackburn have moved above uh, Arsenal there. Arsenal down in, back into 10th. <laughs> um, but yeah... Um, Portsmouth minus 22 goal difference. Minus 22. So before that match today, they were on minus 15. They conceded 50. They've conceded more than anybody in the league now, I believe. I don't think there's anybody higher than that. Um, Blackburn have actually conceded 48, but yeah, it's done their goal difference no good. Um, you know, because when you look at Bolton and they're on minus 20, you know, it's still to play for, but they need a win. They need a win, and so do uh, Charlton. Charlton actually um, are all but relegated now. They'll go down next week if they can't pick up a win, and Bolton would have to lose 
So yeah. Anyway guys, fixture 29. To start off, Blackburn are going to be playing Fulham. And Fulham trying to hold on to their European place. Um, Middlesbrough and Bolton go head to head. Bolton, man. Oh, just, uh, just a point would pretty much be good for them, even that. You know, um, every point's vital now. Liverpool are playing Manchester United there in the uh, derby game. Uh, Charlton are at home to Aston Villa. Nothing less than a win is acceptable for that. But, um, you know, if Bolton were to draw, then it's game over anyway, pretty much, isn't it? Um because they ain't going to catch Manchester City on uh, and points now. Uh, Manchester City are playing uh, Tottenham at home. Um, Chelsea are away at West Ham and Portsmouth are away at Newcastle. That's going to be a big game for them. Although Newcastle haven't had that great a season. I think they're, what, 11th or something in the league? So, uh, yeah, guys. Um, let's see what happens uh, next week then. We're at home to Arsenal. Arsenal, one of the teams being able to stop us this season from winning... Uh, in the league so uh, we, we want some revenge on that next time man so uh, join us for that one please do car it subscribe and share as always I will see you for the Arsenal game next time take care <laughs>